Hi Libra, it's Elle here to uh, do your 72 hour energy reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Libra. Thank you Lord God for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. So we have the Three of Wands. We have the Queen of Swords. All right. I just heard executive of state or of the state, a state, executive of, of the state. I don't know. With the um, four swords here at the bottom of the day, I don't know, there is, it's like a death or there was a death. Um, someone's being laid to rest or someone was already laid to rest. If that had already happened, it looks like you went to the funeral, you said your peace, you made peace with the deceased and you moved on, you kind of turned your back on. Um, I don't know if these are friends or family, family members or siblings. There's a lot of chatter in terms of what's going on with you. Um, it seems as if you moved away, you wanted a new life, okay? You just wanted to be done with that. Um, there's also somebody wanting to communicate with you. Let's move away from the death. Somebody wanted to communicate with you, wanted to talk to you. This could be a sibling. This could be friends, cousins, family, people who are close to you in your community. Community. They feel like they want to talk to you, communicate with you how they're thinking um, about maybe your move or you moving or your expansion or your new life. It seems as if... Um, I don't know, Libra, you kind of cut some people off or you put some things to rest here. You're thinking about, you know, far-reaching goals are on your mind right now. Uh, you're thinking about your new life. Um, you're trying to keep peace and maintain the peace with um, a masculine energy within your home, uh, within your foundation. And it, it seems as if you feel like you just don't need all of the extra input. I'm just heavily getting gossip and it's people who are far from you, who live far from you or just far from you. They don't have um, exact reach to you. You know, it would be a drive to you or a flight they would have to get catch to get to you. I don't know. Um, you've also turned your, it's like you turned your back to something or somebody's waiting for you to turn back around, but you've turned your back on a, a specific person or a, a, a specific group of people people are reading you as just not engaging not involving in family matters siblings siblings keep coming up Maybe early on in childhood, you learned that you just got to take care of everybody, you got to do for everybody, and you just started to really shift that paradigm, that philosophy, and say, it's, that doesn't work for me. So you turned your back here. Um, you decided to cut off some people, places, things, events. I don't know. Um, you're living your own life and you're doing your own thing. You wanted a new life for yourself and you knew that you couldn't take the old with you. I mean, when does that ever really work for anybody? I want a new house. 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 I get a new house. And then I say, well, I would like to take the old house with me. Right. It doesn't make sense. We have to really start being practical in our thoughts. If it doesn't make sense, it just doesn't make sense. So it's like when you say, I want a new, I'm new, I want a new life, I want a new life, I want new friends, I want to live in a new residence, I want, I want everything new. And you start cutting off people, or people start cutting themselves off by just acting how they really are. That's because what you're manifesting is new. You can't take the old with you. So the universe is just trying to help you get your new, your new everything. Because the Queen of Swords talks about um, understanding in order to have a new life, I gotta cut off a few things, a few people, 
um, an old way of existing, an old way of doing, you know, so um, you just can't go back there. Or, or if you do, you just know what it is. You're getting old stuff. You're not getting new stuff. You're not getting new people in old places. Not very seldomly are we getting that. You were at an energy of thinking, making long-term goals and plans for yourself, bringing it in, manifesting it, meditating on it, and then it has returned itself to you or it's returning itself to you, and you're ready to be the executive in your life. You're ready to show up. Um, it says get counsel before you cut something off or cut something out. Someone, something, get counsel. You know, um, seek counsel. Because the Queen of Swords is serious about, I'm just not doing it. You know, when you we show up in that energy, this is a fixed energy. Scorpio, Aquarius. Sometimes she, she manifests as Virgo. Um, when you get in that energy, you're just fixated on, I'm not going back. I'm just not doing it. You're looking forward to the future or what it holds for you because you've been manifesting new and meditating for new. Um, and you just understand that you just really can't go back to maybe old friend groups, old places, old this, old that. And you don't want to. If you have to visit those places, then that's exactly what it is. A visit and then it is back to where you find home, peace, serenity, solitude. You also cut somebody off because there is suspicion of infidelity too. Suspicion of not being the only person. This person is waiting for you to come back to them. They feel like this is what you do. You kind of displace the energy you've got in your masculine. You had a thought and you executed on that thought. That's masculine energy. And now this person is in their feminine energy because threes are feminine energy. And they're waiting for you to come back. So now you're the masculine or you're working in your masculine if you're a woman. And if you're waiting for a man or a man is waiting for you, he's in his feminine. Okay? He's in his feminine energy. So this is what I have for you, Libra. If it resonates for you, go over to the website. Book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. Pay for your question. Receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Me A Coffee link. Thank you, Libra. Many blessings to you. Take care.